Go ahead. See, Steve, we've always had it. Attic, master bedroom. Look, now I'm giving a house tour in a house tour. Walls here. Yeah, I'm showing you how strong my walls are. I've come a long way, I gotta say. We had our ups and downs, our downs and ups, and our all around up and down. <laughs> <laughs> We've been practicing this our whole life. It's, it's scary. That's all for today. This is the TV under construction right now, as you can see. We just built the foundation of it. And we hope to have it done by, say, April. This is literally our first HGTV show right here. It really is. Welcome to our humble Here's home. Home. Look, you built a house. What is it called? Mountain Bike Central. It's a lot of work feeding these boys. <laughs> But what do they usually eat? They usually eat chicken noodle soup and bananas. Steve, did I help you with your forts and you know? Apparently, and I don't remember. I only really added I had the house together. <laughs> and later on this year, we'll have a mountain bike movie. movie. We'll be out in around June, July. June or July. And I'll be the house Starring bike. Ma She'll still be there. Mac and Chuck. I noticed that. You ignore me entirely, but you don't kick me out. As you can see, we need some walls. The shack looks like a shack. Maybe a roof. <laughs> well, I... We used all rough cut timber, concrete fireplace. Hi. I am in charge of the fire right now. That's what we do now. Uh, if we could have dug some white paint out of the dumpster, it would have been perfect. It's tough work. We had our ups and downs, our downs and ups, and our all around up and down. <laughs> You're like literally giving us a tour of your project. Uh huh. You're hitting the drywall. <laughs> you do the exact same thing now. Showing you how strong my walls are. We didn't actually do a bathroom. You just said go outside. I just used the stream. I I am is what I am. A shelf. It's just gonna be covered by wood. I put a shelf in. And I think I accessorized it. I've come a long way, I gotta say. I mean, you gotta start somewhere, though. Hi. Hi. Oh, yeah. You're gonna have a great career. This is where you got your start in decorating, right here is the dollhouse. Let's take a close up on the dollhouse. I loved my dollhouse. I rearranged the furniture in the dollhouse all the time. Attic. Master bedroom. Look, now I'm giving a house tour in a house tour. Let's see if this room's up to Leanne Ford Parr. Oh, my personal favorite. Leanne Ford. I definitely had a girly room. Your room changed over and over and over, probably three to four times before you went to college. Well, I would always rearrange the furniture, that's for sure. Where's the room a closet? With all your accessories. The bottom accessories, the second to bottom accessories, the house, and all that other junk. That bathroom's funny because we each had our own towel color mm -hmm. so that we knew not to touch each other's towels. That was a good way to stay friends. Beautiful. Sinks. I had the girls' sink and my sink. That was big. But I wasn't allowed in the bathroom at the same time as the girls like brush your teeth and stuff like that. No, because you're so loud. Are you still OK? When I was maybe in high school, I ripped up that wallpaper and painted that bathroom and like redecorated that bathroom. Steven Ford, I am a little messy. This is before I decorated my own room. This other than the Lambo, which is awesome. Lambo? The Lamborghini. Oh. Every boy's dream car at 10 years old or whatever. Moose head. That moose land is actually in your house, I think, painted white. Yes. I want it back. Too late. Later, I decorated my room, and it was just like a collage of snowboard pictures and mountain bike pictures and like ski pictures. It wasn't very good decorating, but it was. It was decorating. It was a kid decorating his own room. You definitely have a life theme, don't you? What's that? Lamborghinis? <laughs> Snowboarding, water skiing. Activities. So, that's all for today for the tour of the Ford's house.
Good job, Leanne. I know. Uh, I just... You even had it back then. I buttoned it up. I remember anytime we were in public, you were quiet and kept to yourself and kind of hung out by mom. But it appears if you're at home in front of the camera, you're a little ch chatterbox. So I didn't talk until kindergarten. They actually held me back a year from kindergarten because I didn't talk. This would say otherwise. I know. See, Steve, we've always had it. We're doing exactly what we have always done. Yeah, construction, home tours. Hosting. And design. It's too coincidental. We've been practicing this our whole life. It's scary. It's weird. Here we are. Here we are. Now I understand why Restored by the Fords exists.